Gives it back to Paul. Paul sends it high off glass. It counts, and the foul. 16 can take the lead. Booker for three. Missed it. Paul with the offensive rebound. Oh, between the legs of Zubac. The game presented by Casamigos Tequila. What a nutmeg, Coach. I think that's exactly what he wanted to do. <laughs> I'm giving Chris Paul credit. I've seen that guy for long enough. I'm going to assume that was exactly oh. the play he wanted to make. A little bump, and they've got some freedom with just a half step. Brewer falls down. That's embarrassing against Chris Paul. I mean, that's really embarrassing. An ankle-breaking move by CP3. And looking, finds Paul with two, with one. Paul for the win! Oh! He did it, and the Hornets have won! Yes! Happy holidays! Yo, all the people we talk about, why don't we talk about Chris Paul? What a great exhibition of clutch play by Chris Paul. Can't let him come through that little seam. Good thing. And Paul hits. He don't miss that. Chris Paul starting to take charge here. 19 points. A unique ability to explode to the rim and get close. So Parker 23 and 9. Oh! And that goes in. These two point guards are putting on an unbelievable show. That was Michael Jordan esque. <laughs>They shoot 49% from three. Paul buries the jumper. A broken ankle. There is a broken ankle in the building, ladies and gentlemen. It belongs to Tony Parker. Breaker with that ability to snipe from the perimeter. Oh, my. Oh, man. Oh, that boy. is some athleticism. Chris oh, Paul boy. taking it right at Dwight Howard. <laughs> who can only grin <laughs> at that play. And a little taunting. Antonio fan, what two better defenders could you have than Green and Duncan? Right there, the presence of mind to gather his step. You see he's limping, he's hurt, he can't even explode off of that leg.